talking about before they get on the ice, the one thing that we would talk about is the kids should stretch. Most of these kids don't stretch anymore. They've sat way too much. I'm sitting right here as I talk to you, so it doesn't help. But their, their posture is terrible. They, they need to stretch. We go through, we use what foam rollers, which I, but the foam roller, I always say it's poor man's massage therapy. It allows you to, to get the muscles ready to stretch. So they should foam roll, they should stretch, and then do a dynamic warm up. And when we think dynamic warm up, think almost like basic calisthenics high knee runs, skipping, heels up to your butt, shuffles, karaoke, that type of thing. So that you go through this process of really getting the muscles ready to play. You get the muscles first you massage the muscles, then you lengthen the muscles, then you warm the muscles up so that they can actually work to do what it is you want them to do. And then when they're done, they, they have to get in the weight room. You talk about consistency, they gotta lift weights twice a week. They should be doing this. If, if you're a high school or even a middle school kid, you should be in the weight room. You gotta find somebody to teach you the basics of strength training, how to do a push up, how to do a chin up. That's if you look at the testing that we did today, we're testing really basic stuff, but we want these girls to be good at basic things. So they're gonna bench press and they're gonna do chin ups and they're gonna do sprints. I always say it's, success is uh, actually easy and hard at the same time. It's not that hard to do, you just gotta do it, you've gotta be consistent, you've gotta put yourself in a situation where you can continue to do the things that you need to do. You, you know, you gotta shoot pucks, you gotta stick handle. There's a, there's a limitless number of things that these kids can do and what they're doing instead is playing another game where they spend way too much time on the bench and way too much time without a puck. I guess, yeah, maybe the biggest thing is just to, to realize that, think in the big picture. And I always tell everybody, the purpose of sports is to help you for life. And I think we get caught up in the purpose of sports being to get a scholarship. And a lot of these kids aren't gonna get a scholarship, but what they learn from playing sports is gonna make them better people. And that's, I think ultimately, that's what we're trying to do here too.